what's up everybody it's your girl desha desha pace and this evening i'm gonna be frying me some fish my husband bought some fish i've already washed it i've cut it it was already pre-cleaned pre-clean but you know how you gotta go over the fish again so i went over the fish again and i um, got over any other residue that was left you know fish scales or whatever so i took care of that um I pulled out some seasonings um, right here. I had some flour, and I'm gonna show you. This is about a cup or so of flour in this bowl, but I'm gonna show you what I need to do to this fish that I just cleaned. Let me, oh, I probably should have adjusted my camera first. So I'm gonna have to wash my hands off again. Okay, y'all, let me adjust this camera so y'all can see this process. And I'm gonna have to wash my hands off again. All right, y'all? Stay tuned. All right, so here's the flour, y'all. Let me wash my hands off again. Or rinse them, I should say. That's the flour. This is the fish. And you wanna make sure that your fish is patted dry. We want your fish padded dry. We're going to work with that one first. I need to get a plate. All right, here's the plate. And these are some pretty big fish that Mr. T got. Because it's soaking up all my paper towel. But we want to make sure that the fish is dry. Okay. I got my grease going already. Cause see what we want to, what we want to happen is we want this batter to stick to this fish. I might need to put a piece down because this fish, like I said, I cleaned this fish. You know, they do what they do at the fish market. And you gotta go over it and everything. So we're just gonna do the fish like that. Let it dry. Okay, y'all see I'm trying to dry it. Give me another paper towel. I got two more pieces. I'm gonna lay one down. Right there. Just so it soak up the water. Oh yeah, it's still got a whole lot of water. Okay, so we just want to make sure that the fish is dry. Okay. You want to dry the fish, pat it, soak it up, however you want to do it. Okay, I'm going to lay it there. I'm going to remove this. Throw that away. Okay, y'all. Like I said, I have some flour in this bowl. I'm going to add some Lowry's. I just sprinkle. Y'all know how I do. I have some onion powder. some Hungarian paprika I have some badaya seasonal I have some black uh oh I have some black pepper I'm glad I looked before I did it, y'all. It'd have been full of black pepper. You know how I like my crushed red peppers. And it never comes out enough, but anyway. A little bit of crushed red peppers. I got some Tony's. I 
have me some baking powder and I have a little spoon I'm going to use that much and can I get rid of that and I have me some cornstarch I have me a spoon. I'm going to mix this all up. Yes, sir. Mix it all up. Okay, we're going to take our fish, we're going to flip it, okay y'all, hopefully y'all can see me when I get over here to this skillet. Or this pot, however you want to call it. Y'all can see you in this thing. Let's see. All right, the grease is hot. It's popping. I'm going to shake all the excess off. I'm going to drop that piece of fish right on it in there like that. I'm going to take this next piece. Y'all, I'm trying to do better with this salt. Y'all know I am. I'm trying to do better, y'all. Trying to do better. Drop all the excess off. And that fish is not deep fried fish. That is not smothered in grease, but I did put grease down in there. Let me wash my hands and get another plate out so you can see the ending results of this fish. Y'all stay tuned. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I finished frying up this fish. I have me some Heinz malt vinegar. Look, this is how I like to eat my fish, y'all. And sometimes I put some mustard up there. I have me some um, sweet baby rays, some hot sauce. just a little bit and I had some cabbage from yesterday that I cooked that's my fish y'all it depends on my mood sometimes I like it fried really hard sometimes I like it <coughs> Ooh, the vinegar about to get me um, a little soft mm. oh let me say my grace Y'all, that's the fat girl in me. I'm always ready to eat. If I see my grace. God is great. God is good. Lord, I thank you for my food. Amen. Yes. And I know y'all see this steam. Can y'all see that steam? Mm. Yes, honey. Mm, mm, mm. 
boy. I don't know why I'm messing around with this. Oh, I got the fork. Ooh, ooh. For the cabbage. The fork is not for this fish. That's for sure. Look. If I didn't tell you earlier, I cooked this fish because my husband took it out yesterday. Yesterday morning, I think. Yeah, yesterday morning. And so, he didn't come down and cook it. So, I said, you know what? I'm going to cook this fish because I hate for it to go to waste. Cost too much. Woo! 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 Cost too much money to be wasting food. So, I have some more there. Uh, he bought actually like three pieces. I mean, these fish were big. And I split the, cut them up, cleaned them, or well, cleaned them again. Because the people clean them at the at the fish market or the international market for you. But I cleaned them again, scraped them. And like I said, I cut them in half because it was so big. You know, and he only bought three. And there were some big pieces of fish. But anyway, y'all, I'm going to adjust this camera. This bone up my mouth because I hate to choke on camera talking to y'all. But until the next time, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. I appreciate it all. It's nine o'clock. I'm gonna finish this fish and this little bit of cabbage. I'm going to bed. I got to hit the floor at 4.30 in the morning. And until next time, deuces. And don't forget, peace, love, and soul. Till next time, y'all take care.